In the Rhone Valley, you've probably heard of the Mistral. The Mistral is a very s severe wind that comes. And when it comes, it blows for days usually. Uh, what is it, odd days, like three, five, seven days it comes, I've heard people say. I'm asking my French friends. No, no, there's no. There's, there's no. There used to be like us, it was like on odd days. Uh, yeah. But not now, anymore. No. Okay. Shame, Christina, you find. Oh, well, you don't get too much in Bordeaux. No. Yeah. <laughs> She's from Bordeaux, she doesn't get it. Okay. But it's because the, the Rhone River is pretty narrow here, the wind really comes through rapidly. When you're in the southern Rhone, it fans out, it's flatter. So the wind comes, but it's maybe not quite as strong. But they are sheltered. This is, as you can see, it's sheltered facing south so that the wind is not going to interfere too much with the growing of the grapes. And this Appalachian, uh, as you can see on the map, is just south of Cote Roti. In Cote Roti, where they make the famous red wines based on Syrah, they're legally allowed to add up to 20% Viognier. Most people don't add that much, but some add a little Viognier to add the fragrance, to um, maybe soften the tannins a little bit. And also Viognier helps to um, stabilize the color in the wines made from Syrah. But this, uh, in Condrieu, if you're making Condrieu, it has to be 100% Viognier, no exceptions. And this is a grape that is uh, very finicky to grow. So first of all, it's very uh, susceptible to frost. And if it you know, buds early, it can suffer from uh, frost. It also produces very low yields. And that's because it generally doesn't flower very well and set during that fertilization. Um, and it also tends to be, has to, you have to pick it ex especially right at the right time. If you pick it too young, you don't get enough of that aromatic character. If you pick it too late, it, the acid drops out and the wine is really flabby. So it has to be picked at optimal ripeness. Um, and it can, use, you know, can gain sugar very quickly and lose acidity very quickly. So you know, we wanna pick and make sure the wine is balanced. But look at how steep these slopes are. And they, they, what they do is they have these cables that run up and down the hillside. And then the pickers, obviously picking by hand, no machine would ever go there. Um, they throw it into these boxes and then they take it down to the bottom of the hill where they can then load it on a truck and take it off to the winery. 